Hey, it's time for Last Night in the Loco on WHHI, powered by LocoSports.com. There was a whole lot of nothing on the Loco Sports front last night, thanks to whatever that monsoon hernado was that flipped my trampoline into the neighbor's yard. But we'll get back into the swing Wednesday night with plenty of high school wrestling and basketball, plus another round of USCB Sandshark hoops in the cove. The Sandsharks return home after taking a couple of losses at Clayton State on Saturday, and they'll set off a new in-state rivalry with the Lander Bearcats. Both Bearcats squads are off to a 2-0 start in Peach Belt play, so Sharon Versip's women will have a tough test as they seek their first conference win, while the men's game features an intriguing matchup of the league's top-scoring offense in USCB at 103.5 points per game, and Lander's league-leading defense that allows just 66.9 per contest. I'll have the call on the Sandshark Game Day Network. A handful of Tuesday's scheduled high school basketball games were shifted to Wednesday, including the Crosstown Showdown between Battery Creek and Beaufort, plus Loco-on-Loco -loco region clashes with Colleton County at Hilton Head and Hampton County at Ridgeland Hardyville. Plus, we have some Loco-on-Loco -loco Donnie Brooks on tap on the mat, with the Hilton Head Seahawks traveling to Bluffton for a region bout with the Bobcats and Battery Creek hosting Whale Branch for a backyard brawl. We'll recap all the high school hoops action and let you know how the Sand Sharks fare in the Cove on a late night edition of the Loco Hoops Report, tipping off tonight at 11 p.m. And if you can't stay up late with us, you can find it streaming on demand tomorrow morning on the Loco Media Network on YouTube. For Loco Sports and WHHI, I'm Justin Jarrett. Until next time, go Loco.